Hello again, third grade. We are going to do the story for Unit 9, a surprise party. I really hope you like it. Have fun! Yesterday was Lily's birthday. Hi, Josh. Are you ready for Lily's surprise birthday party? No, we aren't. And Lily arrives home at four o'clock. That's in one hour. Ravi helped Josh and Dad get ready for Lily's party. We made a cake. Can you decorate it, please? Mmm, chocolate. My favourite. Josh painted a message for Lily. A A P P Y B Dad made some sandwiches. Oh, oh dear. Look at the time. It's 25 to 4. Dad, Josh and Ravi carried the things for Lily's party outside. Hurry up, Josh. It's 10 to 4. I'm coming, Dad. Mind the step, Josh. Duh. Josh fell down. What a mess. Are you okay, Josh? Yes, I am. But look at our clothes. And look at the cake. A few minutes later, Lily arrived. She was very surprised. Happy birthday, Lily! A birthday party for me? What an amazing surprise! Lily saw Josh and Ravi's clothes. You're a painter? And you're a cook. You look great. Um, yes. It's a fancy dress party, Lily. <laughs> <laughs> now that you have seen the story, why don't you act it out? Maybe you can ask your family for help. Now it's time for you to read and correct the sentences. Are you ready? Rabbi arrived at two o'clock. What's wrong in that sentence? If you need time to think about it, you can pause the video. That's correct. Two is wrong. What is the answer? Three. Rabbi arrived at three o'clock. Josh decorated the cake. What is wrong? Josh is wrong. The correct answer is Rabbi. Rabbi decorated the cake. Josh painted a picture. What is wrong in this sentence? Picture is wrong and the correct word would be message. Josh painted a message. Remember, if you need time to think, just pause your video. Dad made a pizza. What is wrong in this sentence? Pizza was wrong. Dad made some sandwiches. Lily was angry. 
What is wrong in this sentence? Angry is wrong. The correct answer is Lily was very happy. Now, what do you think about these questions? There is no right answer. Were the children happy at the end of the story? Do you like doing nice things for your friends and family? What nice things do you do for them? Think about this. Let's make someone happy today, okay? Okay, everyone, let's do the adventure block together now. Remember, first we're gonna check out which ones are the wrong words. Then we will write the correct ones. Unit 9, Lesson 3, Activity Book, page 92. Activity 2, listen and circle the eight mistakes. Listen again, write the correct words. Our Adventure Blog by Lily, Josh and Ravi. In this adventure, Josh, Ravi and Dad prepared a surprise birthday party for Lily. They didn't have a lot of time, so they worked quickly. Ravi decorated a cake. Josh painted a message and Dad made some sandwiches. The party was outside the lighthouse and Josh fell down. He had a lot of paint on his clothes and a paintbrush was in the cake. Lily arrived and she was very excited with her surprise party. She said that Ravi was a cook and that Josh was a painter. It was very funny. OK. If you need time to think a little bit longer, pause the video. Here are the answers. On the next slide, we will be looking at the correct words. Are you ready, guys? Here we go. Unit 9, Lesson 3, Activity Book, page 92. Activity 2. Listen and circle the eight mistakes. Listen again. Write the correct words. Our Adventure Blog by Lily, Josh and Ravi. In this adventure, Josh, Ravi and Dad prepared a surprise birthday party for Lily. They didn't have a lot of time, so they worked quickly. Ravi decorated a cake. Josh painted a message and Dad made some sandwiches. The party was outside the lighthouse and Josh fell down. He had a lot of paint on his clothes and a paintbrush was in the cake. Lily arrived and she was very excited with her surprise party. She said that Ravi was a cook and that Josh was a painter. It was very funny. Again, guys, if you need more time, just pause the video. I'm going to show you the answers now. Those are the correct words. Time, cake, sandwiches, lighthouse, clothes, cake and cook. OK, guys, I'll see you next time. This is the end of the story lesson. Have fun. Bye bye.